Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, I just broke it. This video is going to be about cameras. What's it called? What is it? Too many Amazon packages. I don't know. This big one. It's really fucking heavy. Uh, anyways, we're here to talk about cameras. So I bought the A6400 and I thought it was going to be amazing. The quality, I've taken a couple pictures with it and I cannot believe how fucking awesome it is. Wow, like I took a decent photo from my Canon with it and then taking a new photo with this camera, which I'm recording with right now, it's fucking amazing. Now, don't get me wrong, I am still gonna pay homage to SL1, Canon. This thing I took fucking everywhere. This was awesome for that time to still like travel with. For that time, I went to Disneyland. And went out to Universal and did my thing. It was great for that. But as time progresses, these cameras do get more expensive and they I don't think they get lighter to be honest, but they, they definitely get smaller. This compared to that camera is a huge difference. By the way, I lost this shit like four times. Like I'm so bad with fucking covers. Anyway. Honestly, it's good quality, but for a vlogging, it's perfect because you can do this, this, and that. But like right now, I'm having trouble like distance-wise because I want to be here, right? Because I'm looking at the camera, but like it doesn't capture all of me. I was with my girlfriend at the time. It was like two, three ex-girlfriends ago. Not, not my problem, honestly. It's just girls are fucking cheaters. Put my hand here, but I have to use that fucking tool. Jesus, this is the problem. Okay, I got the mount. I completely forgot about it until I made a video. I was like, man, I hate that fucking sound. The next video is you will not be hearing this bullshit. Better. Um, so she had wanted to buy a camera because she was doing some like cinema makeup, like legit movie makeup type shit. And it was awesome. Like she was doing her thing. She did monsters and she did some cool ass shit. Oh, here's the photos. Yeah. Crazy shit. The penguin, you know, it was my idea. I wanted to do the penguin versus guy girl version, you know. I, she made a demon, I, that was not my idea, that was hers. She did some stuff on me, like I got beat up or whatever. And, and it was cool, like, but apparently, if you don't have your own camera, and then they don't, the photographer doesn't take photos with your camera, you don't get the photos that they took with their own camera. Apparently that's how it is in cinema makeup school. I don't know, I never went there, but that was 2011. You know, growing up, where I grew up, you don't, you don't get exposed to like expensive stuff like that. You do have expensive things, but not like, cameras like we had a camcorder back in the 90s when no one else did i mean that was a big deal and it was sony but um at the Panasonic too we have a jvc we had so many cameras but not like an actual camera camera we always had like the little disposable camera or the one you put the film in you take a photo and it wasn't a quality video camera to take pictures with so finally when i when i met this person you know obviously i was with her for two years or whatever and i used the camera ever since then i was kind of hooked but damn the quality and the photos are like amazing i want one one day i broke up with her after her cheating and then I moved on and then met another girl and she was into photography kind of too and, and then that's when I slowly got more into photography taking photos we're like damn we're, we travel so much we go so many places or oh, when I went to Cabo or Ca uh, where else did I go uh Cancun I went so many places I ended up investing into the M50 but you know for being for being manual and being legit like like, like this I am still okay I move a little bit okay <laughs> but I'm I was taking the fucking photos very still blurry photo every fucking time oh my god I can't do this I, I can't do this. Took as many photos as I could in the middle of the freeway, fucking cars going like this by me, you know, and uh, didn't give a shit. Learning from that camera and having it for a short time, honestly, I, I had paid like, I think seven, like $800. I had it for like four months, three months, something like that. I, I did not want to sell my camera, but I had a buyer when I went to SF. Um, let's fucking open this thing. They nickel and dime you for everything. I had to buy the Sony charger. They smashed my box. Not fucking cool. I really enjoy making videos and I love creating content. It's exciting for me and it's creative. I get to be myself. I don't have to be judge or someone's tapping over your shoulder. You're doing that wrong. Fuck you, you know? So I like what I do here. This I didn't buy this expensive camera and, and, the, and the reasons to make money, but if it does, cool. If it doesn't, 
it is what it is. I like sharing my thoughts and my ideas, and I, I love making new friends and connecting. That's the main reason why I, I do these things. Life does not let me finish or make videos because I am busy, 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 busy. You know, changing lives and moving and, and going to a new place by myself, working nine to five. It's really hard. But when you have something that's passionate for you like this, this is very passionate to me. You try to make time for it, and that's what I'm trying to do here, even though I have a lot going on. Either way, subscribe, follow, follow me anywhere. It doesn't fucking matter. Let's make friends. Let's be friends. Let's hang out. Take care. Later. Ah.